Hi everyone. Now I'm going to show you how to install Xilinx with virtual machine. Let's start with downloading process. To download a virtual box, we will click this button. Of course, I will share this link to you. I will not download it because I already download these files. But about Xilinx, we will click last version of Xilinx with Windows 10. And let's click here. Before download Xilinx, you have to create an account on AMD. After that, you can download it. I already have an account, so I'm passing this part. Let's log in. And here we will enter something like first name, email, company name, blah, blah. I already entered these things, so I'm passing this part. And I'm clicking download button. As you can see here, we have approximately 15 gigabyte file and also I already don't download it, so I will cancel. What about the installation? Let's start. We have two files. These are virtual file, virtual box and Xilinx. Let's start with installation of virtual box. Actually, it's very easy to install. We are just clicking next button. If you want, you can change location, but I will not change it right now i will not create shortcut on that many entries so i'm not taking these buttons and that's all about virtual box yes uh important point here please be careful here i'm starting virtual box and i'm gonna show you something if you try to install virtual box machine before i mean for example, most of people try to install Xilinx and they have a lot of error. To prevent this, if you have this part, you have to download it manually. Like this. Download all files. If you do not have it, you don't need to do anything about it. Now, let's continue. If you have any uh, error while installation, this thing will solve your problem. Let's continue with Xilinx. Uh, this is Xilinx setup. I'm starting installation. Yes, I will click next. Continue. There is there is nothing to worry about. It's okay. We will agree these agreements. Next. If you wish, you can change your download location, but. I will not change it again. Yes, and install. Uh, in this part, we will wait for a two or three minutes. I don't remember well. After that, we will continue. Uh, yes, after waiting for a while, as you can see, your installation completed successfully. Let's click OK button, and then let's try to open it. Xilinx Platform Studio. Opening. As you know, it's working on virtual machine, so it is opening like this. Uh, if you wish, you can make it full screen from here. Switch. Yes, as you can see here, it is working like this and there is no problem right now. Uh, that's all I can say about. I hope this video will help you. Have a nice day.